told you we was giving you the okay, okay, back today to make a way. He don't uh, try to take Recently, I teamed up with some L.A. homies, homies. Shout out to the homeboy Westbread Diamond, and we put together a real motherfucking movie called yeah. um, Baby Gangster. It's on, it's on um, Amazon Prime yeah. right now and shit. And Baby Gangster's kind of big, homie. Got, we, we basically took real, real homies, real active homies from all over L.A., San Diego, Southern California, real live, known, reputable gang members, homie, came together, showed that we could do it, and made a dope ass flick. It got um, Sling Johnson in there and um, me, Compton Menace, uh, a few other homies, but real, real movie, real budget movie and shit. COVID fucked up the release and shit like that, but we did something special with that. So just making movies has been part of the whole shit, you know what I mean, the whole time. For sure. Um, did you feel like that was important to get like real street dudes in the movie instead of, you know, actors playing yeah. roles? So talk about that, because I, I understand it, but I, I would just like you to. Well, our thing, homie, was about keeping it authentic. And then as far as, like, making movies and shit, we've had our, t our stories told, bruh. But they, they haven't never really been told. They told by people that live in the hood or from around the hood, but never from somebody that's really from the hood, like, from the, na from the gang. Yeah. You feel me? To tell the inner workers. If you see the movie, it's a lot of authentic shit in that movie that's not ever been seen before. It might be small shit. You might not think that they're that whatever, but the real way that this shit happens is what we showed in this movie. We just wanted to show the real shit instead of the glorified, glamorized Hollywood version of the shit, you know? For sure. You got another movie um, that, that you're working on with Nick Cannon, correct? Yeah, it's out right now too. It's called She Ball. Um, like I said, this COVID shit, homie, like fucked a lot of the releases up. But uh, it's a big movie, bro. I got a small role in it, but I worked on the, on the soundtrack, you know, mm -hmm. and I got a, a couple couple songs on there, a couple songs in the movie. Shout out to the homie Damu. Me and Damu put out an album a few months back called um, 23 Blocks. That's my, my, my rhyme partner from Dago. And uh, we got a song in the movie called Elevate. And um, I also got another song on there called um, Big Homie. And um, it's uh, with, with Neo and Eric Bellinger on the song. And... Um, yeah, bro, that, that movie big. Chris Brown in the movie, uh, Cedric the Entertainer, um, um, Nick Cannon, a lot of homies, a lot of big cats. Uh, Faison, Love, dope flick. Movies, movies is just, it, it don't take no real motivation, homie. It's just something I you know, always was with. Yeah, for sure. We went to SCPA, homie, went to Creative and Performing Arts School in San Diego. A lot of cats did, it was in the hood. When I was little, so we got we kind of got that shit in us. Nick went there too and shit. It was right in the hood, you know what so I mean? So what did they? It was like focus on doing artistic type. Everything, of stuff? everything, just like Fame. I don't know if you ever seen the movie Fame. You ever seen Fame? Fame was a movie from the '80s that came out. All creative arts, acting, dance, music, all that shit. Yeah. And if you was a little slick hood dude, you wanted to go there because the girls ran around the leotards all day at school and shit. So we would just go there and then we'll just sign up for whatever was the coolest elective stuff because we fucking we do drama. We yeah. just go acting, city class and make up shit. And but then we start really learning shit because our teachers was real actors. It was in real movies and shit, real, real, real ass movies, you know. And so uh, I guess it was just in us from back then. I always wanted to make some movies because we kind of had fast know how. Shout out to the homie Shake the Mirror too, man. Uh, 99 North. That was another flick I was in with the Fresno homies. Yeah, that.